My roommate and good friend Michael Gar is an avid lover of sports. If he's not studying in our dorm or at the library for class the next day, he's usually outside kicking around a soccer ball or at ping playing some kind of sport. I decided to interview him to find out why he loves sports so much and how he uses them as a tool to relieve stress. I wouldn't say it would make me more interesting than the regular person, uh, but I do like playing a, a lot of different kinds of sports. Um, and really, I guess you could call it a, a, a my hobby, uh, just because, I don't know, it releases the stress um, from all the schoolwork I have, um, and it's just something I, I've always done as a kid, and I keep doing today, uh, and I just really have a good time doing it. Uh, my favorite sports, um, my one favorite sport would probably be basketball. Um, I've always, I guess, been able to play that the best, uh, so I've enjoyed that the most. Um, but I love playing golf, uh, and then like pick up soccer and football. I mean, I'm not a big guy, but I still like playing football. Um, even like street hockey. Uh, I mean, basically any sport you can name, I'll, uh, I definitely enjoy playing. But uh, basketball's probably my first sport. I probably uh, began playing sports, you know, I mean, just as a little kid, uh, you know, probably when my parents signed me up for, you know, Little League, um, and then, you know, I played soccer at a really young age, and, you know, I just, I loved it, uh, basically everything about sports, uh, just like the teamwork, and just, um, you know, playing, playing the game with your friends, and just having a good time on the weekend, um, you know, and then I, you know, just stuck with it. Uh, eventually I started playing basketball and I would do like flag football and, um, you know, other stuff like that. And, uh, but again, no matter what sport it was, I would, you know, I would really enjoy uh, playing it. Well, I think there are two kinds of skills when it comes to sports. Um, you know, for, you have to have the physical skills. For example, in soccer, you have to uh, have good footwork, um, be quick, uh, and, you know, have agility. Um, in basketball, you have to have good hand-eye coordination. Um, but as far as the other skill goes, you have to you have to be able to have like personal skills, and I think that means like having good teamwork and not uh, putting yourself in front of the team, so your um, so your team can have the most success. Um, so I think again, there you know two kinds of skills, and if you you know if you have both of them, I think you can have a really good time in sports and be uh, successful.